To build a voltage regulator circuit, we start by soldering on our voltage regulator IC. We need to make aware, using the IC's data sheet, which leg is the input, which leg is the common, and which leg is the output. Place the voltage regulator onto the Vero board. Use your hand to hold the board to stop it from moving. Clean the soldering iron, add some solder to the tip, place the tip in the corner, and feed through the solder on the other side. If there is not enough solder, just add some. Repeat this for the other two legs of the voltage regulator. When you have soldered all the legs, cut off the unwanted leads as shown. From the data sheet, we know the leg the input is. In the video, it is on the right side. We will now add an electrolytic capacitor, which we know is polarized. The longer leg on the capacitor represents the positive. The positive of the capacitor will share the node with the input. The negative of the capacitor will share the common node of the voltage regulator. Put the capacitor through and then bend the legs so that it does not fall out. We now solder both legs of the capacitor onto the Vera board and then cut off the excess from the capacitor's leads. We will now add another capacitor. If the spacing of the leads is large so that the component does not fit into the desired tracks, you will need to create a link. Place in the capacitor with one leg, sharing the common node of the voltage regulator. Whenever you are putting components in, try and place them in a way that you can read its values at a later time. We now solder the capacitor leads into place. As one leg of the capacitor is not sharing the node of the output of the voltage regulator, we create and solder a link that joins the leg to the track we need. If the link is not sitting correctly, you can reheat the solder and adjust it accordingly. If you are not sure if another component will be placed on a track and you do not want it to share the node, add a brake to either side to close off the node. We can now add some wires that will connect from the input and output of the circuit. For the input, we connect the wire linking to the input of the voltage regulator and a wire linking to the common of the voltage regulator. For the output, we connect one wire to the output of the voltage regulator and the other to the common of the voltage regulator. We have now built a very simple circuit and have learnt how to solder correctly and how to use the Vera board correctly.